Hi guys, Jessica here. Um, just wanted to show you how I do my daily to-do list for um, my push goal. If you don't know what I'm talking about, Shalene Johnson does a great program. It's called the 30 Day Push and it <clears throat> just kind of outlines how you can set goals in your life and how to get them done, actually get them done. So just throwing words into the air and hoping that things come about. Um, <clears throat> anyways, you can go to her website, shalinejohnson.com, to get more information about that. Um, but in it, she kind of talks about using a phone app. Um, there's tons of great phone apps that have to-do lists. Um, I just recently got a smartphone, so I'm not really into that yet. Um, I've always been a pen-to-paper kind of person, so um, I use my day planner. Um, I got this from Erin Condren. She's really great as well if you like organizing type stuff. Um, as you can see it has pictures of my babies, my family, um, and it has monthly oops, monthly tabs and then um, weekly. So you can break it down by both ways. So basically every morning um, I get my coffee and usually I'm standing at my kitchen counter doing this, but <clears throat> had to set up the camera, so I'm sitting at my table. But basically I'll just go through, today's Saturday the 14th, Valentine's Day, um, and I'm gonna write down all the things that I wanna do today. Um, so, one thing I was gonna do was the YouTube video, I'd actually written that down um, yesterday, because it's one of my goals. So um, I'm going to check that off right now. I like to check things off too because it kind of keeps me accountable. Um, but my other goal for today was going to be starting a blog. So I wrote that down in the morning. Um, it breaks down morning, day, and night. So you can kind of separate it out that way. Um, and then I'll usually put my work out in the afternoon because I'll do those usually when I come home from work each day at 3. On the weekends, I tend to do them in the morning just to get them out of the way. Um, on the bottom, I have, uh, it says meal planning and prep. I'm running a cleaning group right now, so that's what we're going to be focusing on today. So that just kind of, you know, puts it in my mind there. You'll see, I also end up putting sticky notes here. These are things I just take notes on throughout the week and just kind of haven't found a place for put them yet, so that's where I end up with them. Um, and then I'll go into my monthly tab and see what I have scheduled for today. So like for here, um, I know I have a hair appointment at 3, so I'm going to write that down during the day. So don't forget about that. And, sorry, throat's getting dry. <clears throat> Basically, I'll just go through um, and look at my day and decide what I need to do. Um, and put it down on paper so I can reference, reference this throughout the day. I bring it um, to work with me and I have it open on my desk all day. So if I think of things that I want to do um, additional to what I had written in the morning, I'll write them down there. Um, like I said, I'll put my little sticky notes or write jot things in the margin. Um, and that is how I do my to-do list. Um, of course, there's many different ways, and Shalene has all the apps if you are a phone person. But personally, I like to just have everything in front of my face at all times. And honestly, if I open up my phone, I'm going to end up on Facebook or Instagram and kind of lose track. So that limits me from wasting a lot of time. Um, hope you enjoyed this video, and maybe it helped you a little bit. I'm um, going to be hoping to post more, usually like once a week, part of my push goal. So... Um, if you'd like, click down below and subscribe or follow me on Facebook. I'll include that link there. Thanks. Have a good day.